So what's the first question that you should ask a syndicator? Surprisingly, it has nothing to do with the actual deal that you are going to be investing in. This one has more to do with their track record and it's one of the easiest ways to tell whether or not they're going to do a good job for you. So this is landmine number three and I like to just ask people, where were you at during the last recession? Did you A, take any properties during the last recession? B, were you able to exit any properties profitably during the last recession? And three, did you have any capital calls at all? Now, some people won't have even been around during the last recession. This is an interesting one because we had such a big bull run all the way from, I would say 2011-ish, 12, multifamily started doing really, really well. Well, if you've only been in the game since 2016, the only storm that you kind of had to weather was COVID and COVID really wasn't that difficult for multifamily. So the question that I would have is, were you around during the last recession? See how they handle that because it's not about what they do during good times. It's about how they handle bad times, especially since we are headed in to a recession that's probably gonna be a couple years long. It is a great opportunity to make money in multifamily, but you wanna make sure that you are with a good operator. So again, the three questions. What were you doing during the last recession? How did your deals work out? Were you able to A, take any deals during the recession? B, exit any deals profitably? And C, did you have to do any capital calls during the last recession? If you ask those questions, it will help you avoid jumping in with somebody who will either lose your money or make you less returns than you were thinking. This is all about following Warren Buffett's rule around limit the downside on anything and take small, consistent wins. If you know that somebody was around during the last recession, the chances of them doing well during this recession are big. So that's one of the questions that I always ask and is landmine number three.